Mm, what's up guys? This is the Rifleman and I am back to bring you to the next episode of my Empire Dead War Let's Play as the Kingdom of Mysore. And in this episode, uh, we are being attacked by two armies of the forces of Russia. Uh, however, unfortunately for them, we are backed up by a full army of our own. So even if this army does get a bit beaten up, we've got plenty of guys coming in as reinforcements. And I'm probably going to want to make sure my artillery comes in. Not necessarily last, but towards the back and put a few more um, infantry units up front maybe my general will come in towards the end as well um, but let's kick off they've got lots of artillery so our cavalry should be able to sweep around and deal with that lots of good infantry still should be a good battle and this will be a good chunk of the remaining Russian troops uh, in, that are currently defending Moscow and it will still take us a couple of turns to get to the city but that's not a problem because we're still going to have to sweep around and, and attack uh, the cities to the east as well so no massive emergencies there and then once the city is taken and one, well, yeah, once Russia is defeated it's going to be a mass exodus over to the east uh, west sorry to go invade the United States or at least land our troops where they <laughs> where they currently are and then swarm in although we might have to actually mop up Dagestan first Okay, guns. Guns up on the high ground. Form a ground battery. We've got a lot of firepower. We're going to use it. Actually, I'm going to group my bigger musket units together. These small units can be deployed separately. Very many melee units. I'll deploy my hillman out separately on the left. Format my cavalry. Spread them out. Spread them out. Artillery is opened up. Focus on their artillery. We need a lot of artillery. Let's work across, work across the board. Don't you don't worry about puffer guns. That is a complete waste. One of you try shrapnel these Cossacks charging in. They should reload in time. Get my general out of there, although he's... One miss. Kipped it one on the back. A miss. This gun team get back to engaging the enemy. Nice radio in square, so that should be okay. That's what our oh, excellent canister shots. Switched around shot. Get back on to attacking their gun line. Come back, General. Bend in the dervishes. Run my cavalry up at speed. Again. To retarget my artillery against battlefield targets. My cavalry is on the route. The 
dervishes should be enough to chop up these Cossacks. They are charging in, bring my elephants over. Mass my artillery on the right flank. Let's fall this flank back. Go in and get him. Cavalry on the right. Good shrapnel hits. Let's get you focusing on that unit with shrapnel fire. Excellent, gone to break. Don't worry about the guns, they're rubbish. Kill the gun crews. Oh, massive route here. Really wanted to protect their purple guns. Get my light cavalry to go after their general. on them. Just keep hitting them. Even as they're retreating. It's pretty ideal. They're bringing up their They're bringing up their um, artillery first, which is nice. Sending the dervishes to attack them on the flank and fix the 105th. So you in against, go in against the Cossacks as well, just to make sure we win. Killed the enemy general. Go for that horse artillery. New men about face. I think they're probably gonna cover themselves enough. The human switched around shot. Call the cavalry. Send in the dervishes on the flank. There we go, they're broken now. Pivot these weak infantry units around to the flank of the 149th. Hmm. 
Now we know what direction their reinforcements are coming in from. Native Lancers, yeah, they went down, but they got the artillery. Artillery switched around sharp. Let's use our guns to smash the enemy that are close because these guys haven't had a chance to fire yet. Open fire! Okay, might actually limber up my artillery and drag it a bit further forward. Yeah, that infantry came back, just charge in, help out. My Afghan hillmen are firing into the flank of the infantry guards. So they're getting peppered at range. Bring the dervishes back. Bring the light cav back. Maybe pivot like this. Yeah, you're going down. 104. That's 144th, look like they're just trying to pitch up to survive. Unlimber the guns. Let's load up and do some shooting. Another full army. How it says this time. See, so we have a reinforcing unit of Hindu musketeers on the way. They're going to form up on this right flank. One of my guns to start plinking away at range. Get ready. Volley. Good hits, you go, cool, they're wavering. Keep engaging. So these guys are now within shrapnel range of our artillery. Cool. Good hit. Yeah, you better run. I'm going to let the artillery keep shooting at them for a while. Grenadiers are shattered. You aim at the third, you aim at the 22nd. Let's, let's make my the, these guys on the left be the ones that shoot at the infantry. 
horse artillery have not destroyed their guns, they've just abandoned them, which is a good outcome. We can now engage, or begin engaging this regiment of 12 pounders. Push up the flank. Okay, the landing shot's close. I think they're not going to be within quick line range from up here, which isn't bad. And there goes the 23rd, although they'll probably come back. Same as the 6th Regiment here. Uh, you guys can stay hidden, they'll march in range. Here they come. Now they're wavering. More volleys! Okay, our redeployments forced them to have started provoking the enemy to redeploy around against our flank. We knocked out a gun. Oh, they've re, re, they've re manned their force artillery. Oh! Prime, prime shot. Absolute carnage. There you go, the hundred and fifty eight. There's no one close. Okay, let's make you guys fire round shot into the seventy third. You have to make them shatter. Re-engage the horse artillery. This unit, they are snipers. Fire short. They're engaging our flank with artillery, which isn't bad. My Hindu musketeers have made it up. Excellent. The 73rd are in range. 158th in range. We'll show them what it means to sit within shrapnel range and not attack. Oh. Guards, some dragoons. Well, they're moving. Not just any foot guards, those are marines. Okay, they've wheeled their flank in a bit. So let's push ours up. My cavalry is just waiting for them, to, for their infantry to advance enough away from the artillery. They're getting a lot of kills and they're getting a lot of experience, these gunners, which only makes them more lethal. Pop in square, that's okay. Engage, engage. 
engage. Engage. You can lay the horse artillery route. Go after the howitzers back here. These marines are... Oh! oh. Slaughtered. I mean, I think this engagement's not entirely not the way that the Russian Empire was hoping. You've made them shatter as well? You are just 24 pound snipers. They've done super well. One gun. Oh, that's an infantry unit. But one gun's caused these all these artillery units to rout. So we can try and engage the 44th, although tricky prospect. They're behind cover. Go for this regiment of dragoons. them in the center. Okay, you men go for the 14th now on the flank. The riflemen look pretty vulnerable. You men pivot. Here come the first foot guards. Send in the cavalry. Pursue the Fusiliers. Charge them, Kizobashi. You can take them. All my artillery. Actually, not all my artillery. You men. Now switch the cannons to shot. The shrapnel shot. Engage the 24th. Both these units engage first. This fast forward times, it's only these gunners that are left. Artillery, ceasefire. Now it's time to slaughter. Should all of you engage the riflemen. Yeah, that was enough. Ceasefire. Get that gun crew before they escape. Excellent. This has gone really well. I needed one infantry. I needed one infantry unit in support, but that was only because my cavalry, my native lance, had broken ran, which was completely fair of them. Uh, they, they did. I did effectively forget about them, and they charged the head of the enemy's advanced guard. Yeah, there we go. Let's bring everyone in. We're probably not going to get the. The one at the end. Now nah, they routed. Just focus on this one. And we got him. That went so well. So, so well. And my artillery. <laughs> this is zero to three chevrons. All my artillery. Just oh, so much experience. This army went from... A handful of new guys to battle hardened veterans in one turn and with them with a resulting boost in their performance and accuracy you feeling concerned now russia you feeling afraid do you feel that we are slowly drawing the noose around you
They're gathering their forces again, which makes sense. And I wonder how much of them, how many of these troops are being recruited out to the east. They're covering the bridge to the west, which is smart. Yeah, sending their agents forward to try and steal technology. They do have a university, so they might not actually need to steal any. Yeah, you're coming back to do some raiding, I'd imagine. Not that I really care what, what Russia is doing. Dirty colony. <laughs> Finally. This might be a bit awkward, though. We've only got one army defending our territory? Yes, we do. Same again, I think. Just shoot the bejesus out of them. A lot of infantry coming our way. we got the great gun, though. So that will be more than enough to see them off. We'll probably bring in some reinforcements from the east. We'll capture this city. This city's their last. And ultimately, even if we lose, uh, we're about to bring a whole bucket load of troops in from Russia. Right. No superbly positioned hill for us here though but we can set up in a more traditional manner mostly two, three then one two three oh I nicked Indian musketeers from my main line. Group. So that means I let my left flank is being held by Indian mercenaries and although I suppose technically I probably want to do this with the Hindu musketeer with the uh, mercenaries and place stakes in front of my roughly in front of my guns. Put a unit of Kizilbashi back here. Put a unit of great guns up here. Pick some bows to defend my guns. And then just spread out my melee infantry. And then my cavalry. Form up. You men get over onto this flank. Help oh, defend. My great guns can focus on the enemy demi cannons. Actually, not in, they're not in range yet. So there comes enemy colonial light cav. They'll get annihilated by our cav, that's for sure. This unit of colonial light cab is just, just bowling straight in. Okay, you've all fired, so now my mercenaries will be safe as they deploy. I think the trees might be causing premature detonations. Do musketeers? Can't oh, can. there. Can't form square because your backs are up against the hill. Send in the Hindu warriors for support. This colonial light cab is just. We're just going to look at you. Commit the camels. Oh, that was enough. Right, 
ray guns from back here. We can do some good stuff. Actually push my Sapaki forward to deal with them instead. There you go, they're all within shrapnel range now. a few down but they are fleeing us successfully there we go try kill as many as you can shattered good come back hey the colonial lights actually came back and wanted to engage my cavalry my camels He might open fire, peel my Sipahi away, let my infantry mow down the native warrior auxiliary. You want to make sure they shatter, that's for sure. a good amount of damage to their infantry block. Bring my lances back because they've crashed into another native warrior unit. Enforcements coming in from atop this hill. Interesting. Bring my general up on this flank. Position my swordsman to be ready. Gunner, switch to canister shot, engage the sixth. Switch to canister shot, engage the second. Even advance forward. Human engage them. Lance is charging. Engage the colonial lights. Great guns fire round shot. Engage the gunners up on the hill. Shattered and shattered. Perfect. Okay, right, let's commit my Islamic swordsman a bit more offensively. Bowman should be firing now. Very weakly. Bring back my mounted troops. Yeah, charge in, give him some help. Same with the general. You may hold fire. Let's 
shrapnel shot. Where's my swordsman? Cut through him. Keep cutting them open. Then my musketeers forward to help out my cavalry. Push forward, slaughter your enemies. I'm not using my melee infantry enough. So I'm going to change that by initiating a general advance. Is that all artillery up there? Looks like it. Let's send a couple of units up just in case. Oh no, a lot of artillery. Go get him. Send in the elephants. Okay, there, shattered. Elephants in. Get them. Great guns. Shrapnel shot. Keep going. You have the momentum. set of artillery. Uh, they're bringing up some infantry. Oh, the mercenaries are being hit by colonial light on the flank. Very well. Storm out towards where the reinforcements are coming in from. We will reform our line. All my artillery switched around sharp. Camels charge the general's bodyguard in the rear. Push my native lancers up. Engage the tenth. My Sapahi look like they're probably gonna break. We kill their general though, that's okay. There we go, we got their general. Nice, recover. Bunch of colonial line coming in. Don't worry, you men, you're coming home. Awesome. Oh. They're getting some hits against us. Okay, let's redirect, or well, not redirect, let's split fire out amongst the enemy units.
you men should be panicking right now because it looks like this is it. Says, shoot straight for this block of artillery. They're already wavering. To break. Excellent shots. You might shoot at some of my lances. We're gonna get you. Smash him. Killing entire artillery teams because they've all limbered up. stuff. No, don't shout anyone, just get over here. Probably shatter some of these running units. Come on, they're only broken, but soon they will be shattered. There we go. Go after the fourth. Push forward, men. Redirect the gunfire. Shattered, shattered, shattered. Confident, concerned, general dead. <laughs> Poor old general dead. You men do this. with our lances. They didn't like that. Okay, now I've got one gun for each enemy unit. There you go. Concentrate all my firepower on the 17th Regiment of Foot. They're not going to be around for long. There they go. Oof. Nice. Yeah, we are going to continue. Ceasefire the artillery. I should just focus on these guys. We weren't, we weren't going to get them all, but let's try and kill a few more. Can we have our turn now, please? Yeah, you better run. Are they going to blockade one of our ports? 
going after Quebec. Yeah, so they got plenty of reinforcements, um, but our job is to just hold. We're going to hold and bring troops from the east over towards them. That's going to be the game plan. Come on, let me in. <laughs> Zaritzin. Too fangy, it's just rangers, I'm pretty sure. Skirmishes, isn't it? Yeah. Siberian hunters. Oh, so we've got sheet metal cartridges, so that means we no longer have any need to do any research at all. We've learned everything there is to know. It's over at Patna. Destroy. Sink some good money into some port upgrades. Nice, nice, nice. Lots of madrasas all throughout Europe. As a result, that means Europe is not earning as much money as it could be for me. Although it would be good to check what my minister is like for Europe. Yeah, actually he's flat, so bring you in. Oh, my treasury minister. No wonder he's terrible as well. So he's just good in general. Boop. There we go. Yeah, so he gained frugal and thrifty. Okay, so this is a good idea to keep an eye on your ministers. Everyone else, four star basic. So f plus four for treasury, plus five for treasury, plus six for treasury. So he's actually the guy for the treasury. You're just four star basic. Okay, that already helped because that was. I was looking at, my, looking at my income going, why is it not going up like at all? Let's bring you over. New men replenish, and we're going to recruit a contingent of native cavalry. We're not going to push. Because chiefly, I'm not that bothered about what happens in this, in this um, region just yet. So, we can start shifting armies over. Yeah, my Jebex got enough space. It's your job. You're going to hold here and replenish. Let's fix Visby. Okay. Let's send a bunch of these guys up towards St. Petersburg. Let's get one turn's worth. To be honest, I probably can even send more than that. fundamentally you are going to push on to archangels you're going to be there in three turns you're going to push on to petrol sky and siege that just for the time being you're going to push up towards comey and be there in two turns the russians are in a difficult position Okay, let's replenish our armies. Your Majesty. If we can get away with one turn of them not attacking us. Your Majesty. Sir, up here are they? Bilkul Tayar. Tayar. Okay, let's send you also to St. Petersburg. Okay. 
because there was one army here I didn't want to move because I want you to head towards this army on the bridge but you can't take him out just yet you men can get to St. Petersburg as well you men replenished let's bring you over to here because those are your troops yes they are nice I mean yeah there they are very much done for um yeah, I think my next plan after taking out Russia is to attack Dagestan, so that I can jump on Dagestan, Greece, Munich, and Württemberg, and then the continent is well, but not the entire continent, most of it, Britain. Let's start to just pre-position my navy, because you're going to be ready to blockade this army navy in Greenwich. Ah, uh, yes, and you guys, I forgot about you guys. Because Dagestan is the next campaign, because they've got a lot of protectorates. I don't really want to go mad in trying to knock them out just yet. Oh, Madrid is 69% Islamic. The Moors are back in town, baby. Let's just put a bunch of forts here to sit on Bristol. Because that's a large army there under Ivan Berry. Okay, right. Let's hit in turn. Because I want everything to tick forward. Can... Theoretically, yes. You can leave Sweden. You're going to go up to here as well. Both of my name, both of my Swedish armies are going to leave together. I mean, this navy doesn't really serve a function anymore, so I may as well bring them over towards Britain. And this army is going to position to fight Württemberg, although I imagine they are probably quite depleted across the board. Same with Bavaria. Um, yeah, let's hit N10. Some artillery coming up, I think. That's right, Russia, what are you going to do? They're going to attack us. That's what they're going to do. Oh, uh, yeah, we're not going to do that. You're going to pull back. First time is not a problem. It's... Yeah, yeah, you're going to pull back. Pull back. Oh, they're going to make it one giant battle of Moscow, by the looks of things. Which would be pretty sweet. Ah, the Petrovskaya defenders are going to Sally. But looking at the timer, I believe it's probably going to be time to end the episode, because I am battle fatigued. So, thanks for watching, guys. Hope you've enjoyed, and we'll see you next time for the continuing adventures of Mysore. Cheers, everyone.